So we had some game pickups here today. We went to lovely Columbus, Ohio. That's one of my favorite places to go. Uh, we tried to travel over a hundred miles to get there, uh, but it was worth it. This is one of the best game pickups we ever, I mean, this is at least up in the top 10. Well, I don't know top 10, but this was a really good game pickup. I was super excited about this one. Um, my wife, you know, she got a couple plushies here, but I know they're not the games, but Luigi. And then we got this nice, um, there were such really good prices on this stuff. This EV case for the Nintendo Switch, it's a really nice case and it has game holding uh, slots. And I think this is nice, but my wife picked this one up. We got Peach, we got little baby Luigi, and we got baby Peach. So I got a decent amount of games here from different systems. First, I'll just go with the one closest to me. Um, this is a great, great price on this game. This is Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. This game is actually a pretty great find. I've always been after this game um, in the case and everything. It's a great find, great game, can't wait to play it. We picked up a couple of uh, Nintendo Switch games. Uh, like I said, this guy had great prices, so I didn't mind spending some money great uh, at cutting deals and everything. We got uh, Carnival games. Now I loved Carnival games on the Nintendo Wii. Will I like it on the Nintendo Switch? Probably. My wife picked this one up. This is Rune Factory Special. I don't know much about this game, but it looks like a really good RPG. Um, it looks like a good time. And this is my baby. This is probably a, li I'm pretty sure this is a limited run on the Nintendo Switch, but I picked up Night Trap. This is a Sega CD classic. I cannot believe I got my hands on this. I wanted it since I knew it was out for the PS4 and the Nintendo Switch, but this is Night Trap, badass. The guy out at Warp Zone in Columbus, Ohio. If you haven't gone to the Warp Zone, go there. J-Man sent you. But he gave he just threw this in because I was buying so much stuff. This is PlayStation All-Stars Battle Royale. I've never played this game, I'll admit, but it looks like it has a lot of PlayStation characters. That's badass. Another great deal we got out in Columbus, Ohio was I said, do you have a Wii Balance Board? Or I looked at Wii Fit and I'm like, I looked at We Fit and I'm like, I really want that game, but I've never had a balancing board. So he actually sold me We Fit with the balance. He actually threw in the balancing board. He sold this whole setup to me for seven bucks right there. And it's actually, you'll never find We Balance boards in great condition. They're always torn up or somebody's got boogers all over them. But this one, look at that. That's actually the best condition we balance board used I've ever seen. Um, we also got a couple of Nintendo 3DS games. As you can tell, we're huge Nintendo fans. But uh, we got Project X Zone. I don't know much about this game, but it looks like it has a lot of Capcom characters, Tekken characters. It's a great game. It looks fun, but I can't wait to play that one. If you don't know this Nintendo game, you've obviously been living under a rock, but this is Harvest Moon. A new beginning. I've never played this one, but I've played other Harvest Moons, but you know, basically you're growing stuff. That was a good deal for that game. Got another uh, DS game here for you. Not 3DS, just DS. Okay, so this is The Vanishing Files, Kate West and The Vanishing Files. So sounds like a pretty good time. Try it out. If you follow my game pickup videos, you'll know that I got Pac-Man and the Ghostly Adventures 2. Well, now I got Pac-Man and the Ghostly Adventures 1. It's not a bad game. I actually like playing 2, so I can't wait to try 1 out. Here are a couple of PS4 games we picked up. Uh, I can't wait to... I mean, the one on the bottom, I'll tell you in a sec. But This is Final Fantasy X0 HD. I've never played this one, but it looks really cool. My wife actually is the Final Fantasy person. What's so different about this one? 
it's like 12 characters you can pick from and it's a story and this one actually looks cool it is very nice the right. battle system looks pretty sweet so i saw this up on this guy's wall and i was like man i have to have that he actually gave me a good deal on it too I think this is a limited release as well, but Sega CD to the PS4, this is Corpse Killer. I could not believe that I saw this on PS4. I know they had Night Trap, but I had no idea they had Corpse Killer. Now I got me a copy of Corpse Killer. This is probably the first game I'm gonna play tonight. I haven't done my reveal video for the system I got, but this is gonna give it away. Don't worry, it's still gonna be a great reveal video. Um, I got flip out on the Atari Jaguar. I've actually been after this game. I'm trying to do my Atari Jaguar collection, and this is one of the games I needed for it. But of course, this couldn't be any better of a day. My wife was able to get this at a good price. The guy was actually dealing with us in Columbus, Ohio. Go check these guys out, play it, trade it. They're great. I, tra I told them I traveled two hours out there just to go to these two game shops, and they were one of them. So I play it traded in Columbus, Ohio. We got Tempest 2000. I've actually been after this game for a while. Um, it's Tempest 2000, you know what I mean? It's, I cannot believe I actually got it. Now, yes, it is in the case and it's in great condition, but I'm not really a case collector. This is what I want here. I want the game. This is what matters to me the most. The box, boxes are great, but this is my, this is my bread and butter right here. I want the game. I don't want to look at a box, but this is Tempest 2000, one of the best Atari Jaguar games ever made. And it actually, the soundtrack was so good. It went on CD, this is a great game. So that was our game hunt uh, pickup lot from Columbus, Ohio. Uh, I love going, as a matter of fact, I think Columbus, Ohio is going to be my new spot where I go out and get my games. Even though it's two hours away, it's worth it. So thanks for watching and we'll be seeing you.